happy people i'm back with another video and welcome back to nail therapy thursdays i do have another haul for you all and i'm super excited so i couldn't help myself i think i have an addiction to shein okay their nail art is just so affordable and so good so i did go back on their website and i got another order um but actually before i hop into my shein haul this is kind of a little bit of a collective nail haul from a few different places i got some stuff from shop miss a um, Amazon, Dollar Tree, and then Shein. So I'm going to just show you all everything I got. Um, I'm going to start with Shop Miss A because um, I actually, it's like a beauty dollar store essentially. And originally when I started shopping there, I would buy just like affordable makeup and makeup tools and stuff. And I noticed they had like a nail section. So while I was at the mall, I stopped by there to see what they had. And they actually had some pretty cool items. So they did have nail art, which I was surprised about. So this is one of the items that they had. It's like these cute little, you know, colorful pearls or whatnot. So I was excited to see that they had like different nail art. So it'd be cool to try these out, you know, in the summertime. And this was only a dollar. So that was pretty cool. The other item that I found that they had is these cool little butterflies. Let me see if I can take this off the box here. So they had, let's see here. Yeah, this little pinwheel with these cool little butterflies. So the butterflies, they come in all different colors. They got silver, gold, some of them are hollow. Um, they even got like orange and pink and purple. I just thought this was really pretty. So um, you can never have too many butterflies. It's gonna be so much fun to play around with. So I picked this up. Um, and then it actually had some rhinestones there. These rhinestones, I think they're just the clear ones, but they come in all different shapes though. Look at that. It's like a heart, a cross, um, a little bit of a flower, a moon, a triangle. So yeah, I thought that was really cool. So I'm gonna have fun like playing around, putting these different types of jewels and rhinestones on my nails. And I figured too with some of these like more affordable nail art things, like if the quality isn't that great, these would be great to just like use and practice with. So I got this. Um, and then I noticed that they had some nail wraps or nail strips, which I really do enjoy. Um, it's kind of like the Incoco brand, you know? So that's what these look like. I guess I'll just kind of hold them up like this. So this one is like brown and it kind of has like some gold, like, you know, stripes in it and different designs by the cuticle area. And it also looked like it had like some broken glass in there, which I thought was really cool. So I wanted to try these out and see if they were any good. Um, they also had a cute like pink and gold one. One had some marble, more gold flakes. Thought that was adorable. This was another one that has like some cheetah print in it with like a little like burgundy, um, like a little burgundy. Oh, actually it looks more like brown or burgundy. Yeah, that's cute. And then we also have another one here that's, um, what is this blue with another marble design here so that's that marble and then it has like the little broken glass again on there so i really want to try these out i really enjoy using these like i said when i'm in between um nail designs and you know i really don't feel like doing my nails i throw i slap these on my natural nails and they normally last me a good like week to two weeks also because i spent like a certain amount they gave me some free sanitizing wipes so I got these and these would be great to kind of wipe down my nail station after I'm done doing any type of nail art or sets. And this one, I didn't even know, if, you know, hand sanitizing wipes came in different scents, but this one comes in a mint scent. So that'd be nice and refreshing. So that's everything from Shop Me Say. Um, and then I did buy some things at, um, I did buy some things at Amazon. And so um, I just got two little items here. Um, I picked up these, um, what is it? This Laza, what are these? Oh, manicure tape. So these are like the little nail adhesive tabs and I got the one with 10 sheets in it. And so far, so good. I'm, I am actually testing this product out right now. So on this particular finger, um, I don't know if you all saw in my last, the video where I did this set, but this, um, after about a week, this one started lifting and I've had this on for about 24 hours now and it's feeling like it's still securing on there. So we'll see how long that nail actually lasts, but I'm testing it out to see how good these are. Um, so yeah, I got this. And then I also got this 3D mold. So, ASMR moment. Okay, 
So I got these 3D molds, right? Like I think I want to play around with 3D art. As you all can see, I'm really enjoying wearing bigger charms on my nails now. So let me show you each one. So this right here is like a rose. And so the idea is you're supposed to just put like your gel polish or acrylic inside the mold and cure it and then pop it out. And then you can just kind of adhere it to the nail. So I thought this was really cute. Or maybe this is a better way to see what it is. So these are some cute little hearts here. And it came, I think, with seven pieces. No, it came with five pieces. And these are some leaves and some flowers. Really cute. We have some summertime ones with like sh uh, seashells and more flowers. Okay. We also have some crowns and butterflies and more flowers. I just think these are so cute. Yeah, really cute. And then we also have some hearts here. Yeah, I like that a lot. Okay, so that's that. And then I did also pick up my very first um, poly gel kit from Amazon. It's this kit right here. Um, I do have a separate unboxing of this, but it was super affordable. It came with a lamp, a couple of poly gels, and a bunch of nail art. So definitely um, check out uh, my video on this. Um, I'm gonna do a separate unboxing of this because this is an amazing kit. So I want you all to kind of see it and see what all comes in it. So stay tuned to my channel and I'll be uploading a separate unboxing video of this item. Okay, and then I did pick up just a few items from Dollar Tree. So, the first items I got here are just some more storage pouches. I just think these are really cute and really chic. So, you can store them for makeup, you can store them nail art, you can put miscellaneous items in there, whatever. You can just, I like them for storage. So, this one is cute. It says, love, live, love, lash. And then they have another one that says Glam Squad. So I just picked up some more of these. I just like them. You could also, too, uh, gift these. Like, so if you have a friend and you want to gift them some items, you can put the gifts inside of these bags. So they'll have a makeup bag plus a gift. So I just like these for just random purposes like that. And the last thing I picked up with this nail art tool from Dollar Tree, it says it's cherry scented. I don't know if I, you know, care to smell my nail art stuff, but I got this because it was kind of cool. So. It's, you can polish with it, you can create a design, and then it also has decor. So this is nail polish here in there, and then there's glitter at the bottom. I really got it for the glitter at the bottom because I just think it's so cute. But yeah, y'all, check out y'all for Dollar Tree. They be having some cute nail art stuff too. And then the last thing is I got some storage containers here. I'm getting ready to organize my nail room. And I just thought these storage containers would be really cool to, you know, organize everything and have everything nice and neat. So I got one, two, three, four of these for organization. And then I know what y'all all been waiting for, my Shein haul, okay? So let me show y'all what I picked up from Shein. The first item that I picked up from Shein is actually this brush. Um, I got it because the color is super cute. And I just wanted a new dusting brush for my nail desk. Um, I think this can also be used as like a powder makeup brush. Yeah, it's considered a cosmetic brush. But I got it really to just dust off my nail space. Ooh, and it is nice and soft and fluffy. Yeah. I think this would be good for makeup too, but that's not what I got it for. Like I said, I got it really just to dust off my nail space. I thought it's cute. It has, you know, it's made of plastic, but it looks really cute and dainty. So this, this is literally what I got it for. I'm just gonna dust my nail area off. And that is it. So I got this. So I was looking on Shein to actually try and find some nail tips that looked like this because I really love this shape of nail. So I'm gonna see if I was successful with that. These are some square shape tips. They were super affordable. I think they were like three or four bucks. And I just wanna see if I maybe found one that kinda is similar to this one right here. Just pull out a random one here. Let me, okay, let me look at number three and see. I don't really like it when they come in these little baggies, but um, I have enough containers to where I could probably empty something out and just put these in there. So let's see if these are similar to what I have on here. And she's a winner. Look at that. Wow. I think it's going to be slightly shorter. Oh, I think this is the exact same one. Look at that. I think this fits perfectly. Yeah, I literally got these just because of the set that I have on right now. And I think this is going to be it. Awesome. So yeah, I found some square shaped tips on Shein. 
Yeah, that's dope. Okay, awesome. So I'm gonna try these out and see if they're any good. Um, I'm just really excited that I actually found some that worked. And this pack actually comes with 500 pieces in it, you guys. So that's a steal. Yeah, it worked. Okay, cool. I'm excited about that. So I got these. And then I also got these right here, which is probably where I'll actually transfer those uh, longer, the, the square tips to I just showed. I'll probably transfer that into this container because these are pretty small. And I think this only comes with like 100 or 200 tips, but these are just like some small square tips. And let me show you all what these look like. They look just like this. And again, I just wanted to kind of test out the quality of them, but I got them in particular for wanting to maybe do like some, sh short acrylic nails or maybe um, do poly gel nails, um, like if I wanna extend it, or even for a quick nail repair if I'm using builder gel. So yeah, these seem like they're nice, they're decent. Um, I might go back and get the white tips so that if I wanna do like a fresh tip look, I could. So that is what these look like. And I love that it comes in an actual box, like that's a steal. And I think these were actually less expensive than the ones I just showed. I think these were like two or three dollars and the other ones I think was three or four dollars. I can't remember, but yeah, got some short nail tips. And then I also, I picked up some more nail art, you guys. I'm really in love with Shein nail art. Like it's so good and so affordable. So that is what I have on my nails right now. That's what these gold chains are. Yeah, I got these from Shein, and so once I found out that these last pretty good, like these nails have been on for well over a week, um, almost going on two weeks now, and so I wanted to pick up some more nail art because their stuff is just it's good quality, you know? So let me show you all what I got here. I got these cute little, um, they're just little crowns, and I thought they were like really adorable, you know? So I have these, and they have like little rhinestones here at the bottom. So I just think that's super cute. I can't wait to put these on my nails and just see how they, they look and how they work out. That's really cute. And then I picked up another stamping plate. I am getting ready to film a tutorial, my first time trying out stamping and showing you all my stamping collection. So I'm excited for that. But these are just some little kitty cats. I thought this was really adorable. I am a cat person, I just love cats. So I thought this was cute. Got like the little meow, the little paw prints and things like that. So I thought that was cute. It actually has music notes on here too, which is a little random, but happy that it's on there. And then I picked up another kind of a cuticle scraper here. It's like, it has a pointy end on one side and then it has a curved end on the other. And I really got it for after my manicures when I need to just kind of clean up my side walls and stuff. I can just go in and kind of scrape off whatever is on my skin and cuticle area. So I got that. And then the last thing I got here are just a few more nail stickers. I really love Shein's nail stickers as well. Um, I've done a couple sets with them and they worked out wonderfully. So these are just like some nice rosy, rose gold roses. I thought these were cute. This, this pack came in a set of three. And then this is just like the, kind of like those chrome lines. I thought that was cute. And it's like two of those. So yeah. Okay you guys, so these are all the items that I picked up in my collective haul. Um, again, I got stuff from Dollar Tree, Shop Miss A, Amazon, and Shein. Um, yeah, definitely go around to some of your local stores and just see if they have a nail art section if you all are interested in finding like some cool and unique nail art. Yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, let me know if there's a certain item that you all want to see me test out next here on my channel. Um, I do use all of my nail art supplies, so I'm super excited to put all these items to use. Um, I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Um, Thursdays in particular are my Nail Therapy Thursday videos, so if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around and join the happy family. I would love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below, and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.